Hello everyone. Today we are going to be making a stir fry that has the base of it as the mushroom and Parmesan couscous risotto. So that's a new product within the last like six months at Ideal Protein. And so what we're going to be doing is actually stir frying some veggies. We are also going to be using some rice cauliflower and we are going to try this also new product from Ideal Protein called the Oriental Sesame Sauce. So we're going to enjoy a really wonderful stir fry. Stir fries are like my favorite things. So here we go. I am making up the package of the couscous risotto and basically it takes a couple minutes in the microwave and then it sets for five to seven minutes so we're gonna see that in a little bit right now um, I'm going to pour in some homemade chicken broth and one of the things I like to do is save my oil for other things like drizzling on my vegetables um, so I always cook in some chicken broth and I like to make my own just because that way I know exactly what's in it. I'm going to put these veggies in here and I'm going to leave the Parmesan for last. So let's just cook up the mushrooms and the peppers and um, then we will add this in later. And so I'm just gonna get this going here, cook this for a few minutes till it is a little, not too soft, but uh, a little cooked. So the mushrooms and the peppers have been cooking for a little bit. And I have some cauliflower rice here. I'm kind of making a double batch, a little bit bigger. So I'm gonna be uh, also doing a double batch of the Ideal Protein Couscous. And then what you can do is just split it in half. And then you have two non-restricted meals. So this would be great for lunch because you're gonna have about uh, approximately uh, two cups of veggies per serving and one cup of non-restricted protein when you do this in half. So we've now added the cauliflower and now I have a double batch here of the uh, risotto here. It looks really yummy and smells really good. Mushroom Parmesan couscous risotto. So we're gonna pour that in there and just again mix everything up the whole process might take about 15 minutes from start to finish it's really super simple uh, i like to cook the cauliflower for maybe just two minutes or so so that it gets nice and done and then we're also going to add this oriental sesame sauce as a flavoring to just kind of Give it a little maybe Asian flavoring, something you might pick up and enjoy for the Thanksgiving holiday. This could be um, not maybe in place of your stuffing with your turkey. So making your couscous recipe that is filled with other veggies. And now just for the final minute or so I am going to add the parsley and um, I'll do some salt and pepper to taste but uh, this is a really really tasty dish that you can have for lunch you could make it the night before take it in a container with you to work and just heat it up it looks super super yummy all right everybody i hope you are planning ahead for the holidays you know exactly what you're gonna have for thanksgiving dinner you've already written it up in your journal you know that you're going to get the right proportions of veggies and protein and the right amount of your ideal protein meals each for that day so uh, try to pre-plan. That makes things not have problems. If you're going to someone's house, make sure that you're taking something that you can eat or it's already, again, pre-planned. 
Have a fantastic holiday, and I will talk with you soon.